Hello Lana. Welcome to Agriculture Lesson for Grade 5. Today we are going to learn about the wild animals. Learners, we are going to learn about living better with wild animals. Learners, what are wild animals? Wild animals are the animals that live in the forest. Learners, some animals in the community destroy crops and harm domestic animals. We should keep them away from the gardens, but we should not harm or kill them. The wild animals are very useful to us or very important to us. Some are dangerous like leopard, lion and others. Learners, we have some of the small uh, small wild animals that we should keep them away. For example, we have mice, moles, rats, hares, antelope, mang mongoose, monkey, swirls, porcupines, and birds. Learners, how can we control them? What are, what are some of the metho methods of controlling the small wild animals? This is what we're supposed to do, learners. Uh, measures that should be, be carried out to reduce the damage caused by the wild animals include use of plants such as uh, euphobias, moles plants, marigold, produce unpleasant smell that repel uh, some wild animals. Learners, you can also use lighting fire in the in the middle of the garden to scare away the wild animals. Spraying uh, crops with the repellent crops such as garlic, rosemary. We should not hurt or kill the wild animals when keeping them away, when keeping them off the garden. Learners, these are some of the repellent crops, uh, crops that we should use. Euphobian, more plants, ma marigold, lavender, mint, hot pepper, garlic, uh, garlic, rosemary, mudball, castaway. They produce unpleasant smell that are uh, that to repel some wild animals. When wild animals like mice, moles, rats, hare, and antelope, antelopes come close to, to these plants, they are driven away by the smell of the plants. The other plants that we can we can use uh, we can use for as a repellent, such as hot pepper, garlic, rosemary, mudball, and cast oil or cast weight. We can use different ways of, of, of keeping them away. Use of sounds and traps. Some animals are often scared by the sounds by, by people talking or shouting. Animals like monkey swirls can be scared away by using the sound uh, made by a radio. A radio is switched is switched on and put in a plantation to scare the wild animals away. Use sounds such as rattle, metal, metallic plates, and human noise can also uh, keep away the wild animals. The wild animals can be controlled by using traps, and when trapped, should be released gently and safely. Runners. Still, you can use the barriers, such as a building a fence, that can be used to prevent the animals from causing damage to crops and to our domestic animals. Using uh, scaring devices like scarecrow, destroying their hide, hiding, destroying their hiding places, make the wild animals move away. Learners, we can also use. Uh, a smell and fire. 
some wild animals are repellent, uh, are repellent to bad smell. Smells can be produced by burning items such as uh, rugs, plastic, or, or tires. This smell is used to keep to keep away the wild animals such as uh, ro rodents. Rodents are the ones that eat roots. Lighting fire in the middle of the garden uh, to scare away the wild animals. We can also use the smelly again and bitter tasting plants. Some animals avoid smearing and bitter tasting plants. This method keeps away root eaters, uh, means rodents, such as moles from the destroying farm, farm plants and the digging holes in, a, in the farm. Learners, let's look at the importance of the wild animals. The wild animals are important to our, our life. The wildlife provides nutrients to human beings. There are some of the animals that uh, are edible. Some of the animals that we can eat like uh, uh, antelope and others. People depend on the wildlife for their li uh, livelihood. For example, if you work in the, uh, in the wildlife uh, company, you, might, you will be paid during the end of the month. The wildlife has a cultural significance. The wildlife are important to our economy because as the uh, tourists as the tourists uh, pay, the government are able to build different structures, schools, roads, and others. Protecting wild animals creates more jobs. Those who protect them, the game rangers, also to can, uh, will be paid to get, to, to get money. Wild animals generate revenue through the local and international tourism. People get jobs for caring the wild animals. Learners, the beauty of the watching wild animals in the natural in their natural environment give a relaxing feelings. Learners, let's look at the care and safety from the wild animals. One. This is what you're supposed to do. Some wild animals can be dangerous. They can be attackers and even killers. They include the wild dog, wild cats, monkeys, and others. Some animals, some wild animals can also be transmit the dangerous diseases such as rabies. We should, we should always keep the safe distance from the wild animals. We should not touch or provoke, scaring, chasing the wild animals. Some wild animals carry the dangerous parasites on their body that can cause, that can cause the, the diseases. You should invite the wild, wildlife officer to safely release any trapped wild animals. We should not play with the young ones of the wild animals because they are very dangerous and they might harm us. Avoid sharing food or water with wild animals because they have different diseases. Avoid eating leftovers by the wild animals. Immediately informing an adult or seek medical attention in case the wild animals uh, scratches or bites you. Thank you, Lana. We have come to the end of our lesson. Thank you for watching and thank you for listening.